Hi, my name is Jeff Temple. I'm Director of Mountain Operations and Facilities Maintenance for Killington and Pico Resorts. Killington Pico is the largest resort in eastern North America. Killington's actually located right on the spine of the Green Mountains, uh, second highest peak in Vermont. We have 1,900 skiable acres, including all the woods. We have 200 trails. The experience that we can deliver uh, with our snowmaking and with our lift infrastructure on a number of different types of terrain, we feel like it's, it is number one in, in all those areas. The important thing to the Killington brand is a long season. So opening early in October, November, and then running as late in the season as we can. Snow making is paramount to what we do. Uh, it's very, very important. We've always been known for it. We have a very large system here at the resort. And that's where our use of air compression and portable power compressors is very, very important to have that ability to run as many guns and to get as much terrain open as we can. Well, what Doosan does with their HP 1600, it's a machine that's evolved over the years and it, it's a very proven product. I can guarantee you the quality of the equipment. State-of-the-art technology gives us IQ systems to run colder air, cleaner air, as well as tier four final uh, Cummins diesel engines, which gives us uh, EPA rated exhaust. Uh, so they, they run clean exhaust and environmentally friendly. Blue Line likes to pride themselves on service. This is what built a relationship with Killington, that when there's an issue, we respond to the issue. They have sometimes very short windows to make snow in because it is a weather-related business. So if one machine is down, it can mean an awful lot of snow on a mountain. So we, we pride ourselves in responding as quick as possible and give them the best possible service that we can give them. And this is what's kept our business over many, many years. With the World Cup coming to Killington this year, it was in November, which is still a very volatile uh, weather period in New England. We spoke with our partners at Dusan and, and talked about what we were gonna need to pull this off at that time of year. We actually more than doubled our air compression plant with the Dusan 1600s. Uh, in the industry, you know, gun spacing might be 50 feet, 75 feet. We actually had major sections of the, the World Cup trail down to like 15 to 18 feet with guns, gun after gun after gun. We really only had a couple days in late October and a couple days in November where we really could make the snow. And this is where that amount of air compression really came into play. In this business with short weather windows, those, those hours that you have are critical and that proved out with the World Cup this year. We had very limited hours. That equipment had to run when it was asked to be run, and, and, and it did. It's all about relationships. It's such a critical component of the success of our brand here at Killington in, in, in the snowmaking uh, end of the process with, with air compression. Our relationship with, with Leo and Dusan is very, very important and very, very critical. Again, a, a company may have a better rate Somebody else may say their product's better, but it's that long-term relationship that's really makes us successful here at Killington.